barber for 46 years. My dad was a barber, so I just kind of fell into it in this shop for three and a half years. Prior to that, I was 24 years at a shop on Pope Street, a couple of doors off of Washington, and I had a shop 12 years. It used to be a men's store in downtown San Francisco, right on Union Square, and I was there for 12 years. And I had a shop in Hawaii for about a year and a half. Hawaii, I lived there in the 60s when I think it was still paradise. And I had a shop in a men's clothing store. Well, I always wanted to learn how to play pool. So I thought, uh, before I brought anything else in, I went out and I bought a pool table. And I give guys beer if they want one toward the end of the day. A friend said, oh, you ought to give it to them at 10 o'clock in the morning because you don't know if they just got off work or what. But it, it's kind of hard to offer somebody a beer at 10 o'clock in the morning. I've got some, several for 41 years I've been cutting their hair. Uh, I've been having my hair cut by Alan for almost 40 years. Well, I'm delighted Alan finally has his own shop after 35 or 40 years without one. He set this up probably four or five years ago, and uh, it's been very pleasant, very nice to come to. I was in the Navy. I was an electrician in the Navy. I wasn't much of an electrician. <laughs> I think I built a motor. And other than that, I was on an aircraft carrier, and I just put light bulbs in the hangar deck. And that was a, everything I did in the Navy, just put light bulbs in. I go by appointments, and when I don't have appointments, I do read a lot. This place used to be a beauty salon, right. I've tried two, other, two or three other places over the years, and it just hasn't uh, been nearly as good. Alan seemed to understand exactly what I like, which is having it cut about every three weeks. <laughs>